All right, what's up, guys? So I, I just before I go into the uh, vlog, I just want to let you guys know like where I'm at and stuff. Um, so I got back. I'm in Pittsburgh. Uh, it's been a while since I've talked to you guys, but I just wanted to you know get my get a vlog out there. I filmed it back in like November. Uh, pretty good. Talked about motivation. Um, but the biggest thing I want to say right now is that I'm going to Rome uh, on Saturday. So I'm actually going to be making a video for that. Maybe two. Just depends. But I really want to um, let you guys know that. I'm not giving up, you know, whatever you want to call it, but uh, I can't, I'm looking forward to uh, this next coming semester, I'm super excited to see what I have to do, I'm, I'm planning to really kick it up a notch and do stuff, things a little differently, so. And now that I hit my reset button, I'm absolutely ready to kick ass and just, you know, destroy this next coming semester, um, can't wait to take, you know, can't wait to do it. So I hope you guys enjoy, and I've got plenty of content coming soon, be patient, alright, so enjoy the vlog. What's up, guys? All right, another day at Defiance College. All right, I'm bringing you my No Shave November self right now. So things have been good. It's been a while. Uh, winter's coming and it sucks. Uh, right now, we're just living the life. Let's see what we get. Okay, so I can finally talk because I just woke up from eating food. So um, today I felt like talking a little bit about motivation and um, my situation because uh, obviously college can be tough and I really hit a uh, stump because um, winter came and honestly I think I kind of have like a seasonal personality disorder because I just always like go from like a guy who always wants to do like a million things in one day and then all of a sudden I just want to tuck away in a blanket. but. Uh, it's like, for the most part, I did a bunch of videos, I did everything, and then it kind of like stopped a little bit when I like came into like, um, challenge and doing work and stuff like, where I couldn't do my extracurricular. And my extracurricular is what makes me really feel like I'm, um, getting to do what I want to do. Uh, like I've said, I've done chess, and I've done yeah, so... I haven't even been meeting with those clubs because I've just been so packed and busy. Uh, and it's just been such a, I don't know, like a semester where I'm just doing a bunch of different things. So for me, like I have my old ways, but now I have to get my new ways for one. So right now, um, I do marketing videos, I make YouTube, um, I do McMaster's, that's a huge project I'm doing right now, and it's sucking up so much time. There's so many things. It's suck up time. I'm also doing tour guys after tour today. Uh, and that's just, you always have to ha do a bunch of stuff. And you don't always have to do it. And another reality is that, like, I was doing all this for a while. And I think I've had this three week span, you know, where I haven't uploaded, but I'm always going to upload, so don't ever fret. But um, the reality is, like, when it's nice and it's beautiful out you you feel like you're engaged and you want to do stuff but then when it gets colder it's the people that can do it while it's you know we want to say cold but people that can do it year round usually win and they succeed so here I am um, I'm starting the, I started the week fresh so today's a Wednesday and you know Monday I did literally like 5,000 things um, tomorrow in Senate I'll be going to um, like create officially like create the club for esports that's going to deal with like doing different events for that kind of stuff like land events, handling money, stuff like that. And so yeah, that that's it. And I, I mean, I, I got sick as well, so that just killed my week. And I had to stop all my habits, I stopped lifting, and you know, I just shut down, literally. It's just like, ugh, like my motivation's just gone. And then, you know, now I'm just like, hey, gotta give myself credit, and you gotta turn it back on. You know, once you get beat down, like, you gotta get it twice as strong, so. In the meantime, I've created a lot of habits, too. My first habit I got into was stretching, because stretching is so important. If you're lifting, you have to. Otherwise, lactic acid and tightness will kill you. Uh, I kind of find out the hard way, because I had a little chest strain right here, and it just wasn't going well. Um, what I also had in the past was a deadlifting issue, where my back just pretty much did not want to deadlift at all so I started squatting again 
any leg day, I'm always stretching. That's such so huge. Uh, I just started recently. I've just done it like once a day, pretty much. Just do like all upper body and lower body. So that's one thing I do. That's uh, just again. I've only done it for like a week now, but I'm gonna try and continue it as best I can. So. And another thing, I also um, saw. I haven't been reading as what much. I killed like three books in the beginning, but then just got so old and I couldn't do it. Um, it's just about sometimes you have to do what you can and what you're meant to do in the moment rather than what you just want to do and, and succeed at. So no matter what, I'm always doing habits and you know, even being out of the gym, it just takes me out of my element and I just can't find any kind of routine. Um, it's just the little things from like brushing your teeth and like expanding on stuff. Uh, like I recently started using like face wash in the shower because once it's cold you start getting more zits and it's absolutely helped me. And you know this is why I lift. I love it. Uh, it just keeps me in it and that's important because in order to stay motivated you gotta keep doing what you want to do. So no matter what I'm always doing habits and you know even being out of the gym it just takes me out of my element and I just can't find any kind of routine. So the point I was trying to get across is that Let's say you want to become good at something and now I think there's a little bit of free will versus destiny. That's what I've been noticing a lot. Um, I believe in God a lot and I know he has plans for me. So at the end of the day, you have to take certain steps to get into certain positions. And let's say I want to be like a YouTube sensation or whatever. That takes a lot of years and right now for me, if I'm not making the right um, steps towards it and I'm lagging then I feel like I don't get anywhere, but in reality, like I need to do other things about myself to make myself a better person and make it better content first. So at the end of the day, I believe that I know in my soul I want to do something special one day. So action will always meet the will always be the determiner between success and failure. That's that's always going to happen. Now, whether you, I have the ability to produce a video every day, realistically, no. Um, I think as long as you're serving at one goal and then you're trying to immerse yourself in as many of the things as you can, then you're going to achieve that. So as long as I'm uh, in college, I'm always going to be able to um, uh, do well. You know, I need to do college, graduate, and then we'll see what happens. So to follow up with how I was talking about how I can do certain things at times and not, um, there's just this kind of like divine timing I've found and you might not see it but stuff just happens for a reason you know like I don't need to per se just grind out of YouTube right now there's gonna be time to concoct some kind of you know you know plan that's just gonna catapult me or something like that you know you can only hope for the best and obviously any person should want to develop their career you know um, you know and I hit blocks. I hit tough times, and that's just the truth. You know, like I got sick, and my chest started messing up. Um, just little stuff that happens. Um, you know, I know my one friend Devin. See, watching this, bro. Shout out to you. Uh, I work with Devin. He he's like, I want to say 24, 25, and right now he's hitting some tough times with his health because he has um, uh, some uh, colon issues. You know, uh, keep grinding away, bro. Uh, and for him, like, he's just got to keep doing what he can do. And the willpower he'll get out of that is awesome. So, that's how it works. So right now I just got back from doing my tour. And uh, I lifted before that. So now I'm literally just going to eat and uh, go to esports. So I'll see when that happens. Alright, so I'm just going to play some Fortnite and bust some 90s and see how I do. Alright, so today was a great day. Um, got a lot done. Uh, right now, you know, I'm just staying motivated, trying to look forward to all I can do. Um, you know, going forward, I want to try and 
create as much change and success here in Defiance as I can. Um, so that always goes hand in hand with motivation. Um, finding that free will slash destiny like interchangement is kind of the best way to do it. And for me, it's just always finding opportunity. When opportunity comes, you just ask, and if it be granted, then you shall reap it. But other than that, you know, um, it's been my day. Uh, right now, I'm just going to eat like a Kit Kat drumstick and uh, watch some YouTube. So, yeah, that's about it. Uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Other than that, um, you know, it's been a great day, and I'll see you guys later.